Welcome to Superstar Cap Bros. Silver Tuesday. I'm Jay. I'm Iron Sparks. And we have a TVP for you today on Neo Planet S. Indeed. Manners are thrown out. Kinda. It feels like it should be Thursday. If only. I'm tired. You're always tired. I know. Is it summer yet? No. Feels like it though. Yeah, 90, what, what's the temperature today? Um, rather warm. I think it's in the 90s, and Vegas has never had triple digit temperatures in April before. Which I don't believe, actually. I believe it. But, uh, yeah. Alright, guys, well, we have a TVP, like I just said. Scouting SUV. No! False alarm. Supply Depot building SUV is out, so uh, let's introduce those players and get into the action. Well, in our bottom left corner, we have our red Terran Odinez. All right. And his opponent in the top right, the blue Protoss, Splash. Splash. Odinez and Splash. Indeed. TVP. Feels like Terran and Protoss are like the two races that really shouldn't be fighting each other. But you know, Protoss are superior. Then how come the Terran are still around? Because everyone was afraid of the Protoss, so they attacked them. We weren't and, afraid and, of the Protoss. And we sacrificed ourselves for yeah. the greater cause. Whatever. Protoss are pretty pretty mean to each other, though. Look at the Dark Templar. Well, they've, they've kind of welcomed them back a bit. They're still evil. They're not evil. They're yeah, we welcome you back. I mean, our, our homeland is kind of gone. Can we borrow yours? <laughs> All right, so a scouting probe does make it into the base for Splash. Just he won't be able to leave. Uh, no, it looks like that other supply depot is queued up to go down. And he's just going to chill there with his minerals. No biggie. Except for that biggie. He, like, parted the Red Sea. <laughs> <laughs> or made it follow him. Yes. All right, so let's see. Yesterday on the Monday show, we talked about... Uh, season 2 is locked and we talked about the new maps or at least the maps that are leaving uh, Neo Planet S staying in the map pool isn't it Iron Sparks? Indeed it is Jay so anything else new in Starcraft land? Um, I don't know All right. I haven't really been paying much attention to the the WCS qualifiers so oh. well, those uh, are going on they're going on. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, that's it for gaming news. Uh, Zealot's going to tear apart this SCV if he can get his side blades on him. I think the SCV should be able to run away. Yeah, I think the SCV might be faster. Yes. Workers are pretty much the fastest units on the field. Yeah, it is fast. Well, they're not the fast. I mean, I think Zerglings are faster. Are they? Yeah. A bit of lag on this replay. It's been a log on every replay. Huh. I wonder why. Um, I don't know. Command center is going up for Odinez, so he's preparing to take a second base. It's definitely a slow game. Well, you know. I wish we could chrono boost it. It's, uh, it's the week of mostly slow games. Really? Probably. I have a feeling it'll be like that. Should we just take a holiday then? No. We already started. So. <laughs> okay, then. All right, Stalker and his two disciples, Timmy and Bippy. Hey, Bippy. I don't know why they named him Bippy, but the what? Mothership Corps just thought. Which one's Bippy? Bippy's the one on the right. This guy. Bippy. Is that why he's not facing the ramp? Yeah, he's. Bippy. I mean, Timmy's not doing that much better either, but... But at least he has, like, the peripheral vision of the ramp. I, I mean, I guess they would have good peripheral vision. And there's the giant eyeball. The Mama Ship Core. Silence. A couple <laughs> Reapers should be just about on the way. I know one is about to finish this SP is still alive up here kicking. Reaper is out all of Accompanied by uh, a few Marines. Yeah, this is actually an interesting move uh, to build the Reaper. I'm, I'm kind of thinking it's a misclick on the queue for Odinese. 
it's just, I mean, you need a couple Reapers to do some effective uh, worker harassment, unless you can micro that Reaper like a boss, which I, you know, it's silver level. You know, it could just be used as like a scouting tool. That, I, way, that way you don't have to waste the energy on uh, scans. But I mean, a, a 50 gas scouting tool seems... It's not that bad. Well, Reaper is moving out now, going up to the left side of the base. He might jump in there, try and get some scouting information in, and then try and pick off some stuff. There is a stalker right there ready for it, though. Reaper is queued around. Oh, gets a shot off on the Nexus, and that's dangerous territory right there. But you know, he's going to be not okay. No, he's going to fly into the Zealots and the Mama Ship Corps, and that's one ouch and spanking. Yeah, but you know, he did get to see that there is four gates all pretty much done and a robo bay almost finished as well uh, is that surprising though i mean it's not anything out of the ordinary well i'll let you know that your phone is going robo bay yeah true and then he's not really going to be able to afford to produce off all these things no he does need to expand if splash hopes to expand or uh, utilize all those production facilities he is going to need this throw down an excess at the natural uh, Odinese does have a second orbital command sitting there on the high ground. We'll probably see an expansion in a little bit. I don't know. He's making bunkers up here. He is. I think he's, like, fearful of some type of attack. Uh, you know, one thing I would like to see Odinese from after getting that scouting information, throw down a factory. A factory would help. Having that tank out early would help against immortals, at least as uh, if the siege tanks can get their shots off beforehand. And widow mines. They do well against all protest units. They do. Uh, they do a little extra damage against shields, so they would help against that. You know, I just Odinese is re reacting a little too much to Splash's. I mean, what Splash had in his army, you know, and what like we're seeing now in the field isn't even what Odinese saw with that Reaper. What do you mean? He warped in most of those uh, stalkers after the Reaper died, so Splash was kind of gearing up for some type of attack from Odinese. Mm -hmm. Well, here comes the Observer. A scan was dropped, but I don't... Oh, it was dropped on the main base of Splash. Uh, and Splash is going to get all the scouting information he needs uh, about Odinese's uh, whereabouts and base setup. And he's going to see mostly 3M with a factor in the way. But I do have a feeling this might lead towards a uh, this is only starport. 2M. Huh? This is only 2M. Uh, I know, but I, I think he's going to jump from the factory to... Well, yeah, he is starting the start gate port now. C3M. Um, move out from Splash. You know, and if he uh, if he throws down some proxy pylons and stays on top of this, I think he'll be able to take it with this wave. No, no. Well, I mean, if he splits all the units up like that, then then no. But but you took my pun. Why? I was gonna say he's gonna try to make a wave with this attack. Oh, I didn't. Even a ten a <laughs> unintentional pun. <laughs> <laughs> Splash. All right, we got a couple of barracks being built outside to help <laughs> defend. Nothing says defense like a barracks. All right, looks like that barracks does go down. No cancel on it. Second one is going to go down as well. Can we get a cancel? Can we get a cancel? No, no. All right, so two barracks picked off a loss of 300 minerals for Odinese, and Splash just trying to regroup his troops, and... What? What? You know, I think he can probably just power through this. I, I do. I think he can. I mean, he has to be careful not to take too much damage, but, you know, he has vision of the high ground. He has vision of the bunkers. Um, Go! I think he'll... Uh, Go! I think he'll be okay. Go! There you go. Here comes Splash! Splish. Splash. Hey, look, we can't see the laser beams again. You know, this this micro is not helping the stalkers at all. Uh, no. But they have that silent laser beam, so maybe it'll help a little bit. I think he's trying to channel his inner Magikarp. Splash, 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 splash. splash as in splash. doing nothing. So I had read that there's actually a splash is like one in a thousand chance of like destroying the opponent. Is that true? Did you ever read that? I don't know. I think I remember reading something like that, but I don't know if it's true. I don't know either. I guess we'll have to go use Splash a thousand times and see if it happens. Jump on that. Uh, Alright, Splash, Splash. 
All right, two well, forges are down, but he's only getting one upgrade. You know, he's not warping in that much. I mean, he is sending these elves in, but they're going to be quickly killed because the stalkers are too far away to deal any type of damage, so the meat shield's not quite working. But you know what? He is going to finally take out the second bunker. Throw down one of those time fields. Time warps. Time warps. Well, he can't now because the mama ship's gone. Well, you know, sacrifices have to be, have to be made in the battlefield of war. These sacrifices are not exactly that beneficial. But that we poor stalker. We leave left. one man behind. He's been left to guard the pylon. Well, Splash, um, kind of, uh, piddles out with that attack. Doesn't even leave a ripple. And, uh, Iron Sparks has been forced to hit the speed up button. But, uh, 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 all right, times four. Here we go. Nothing, 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 nothing. Never sit and let your opponent build up. Because now we have a drop coming in from Odinese. And considering the placement of Splash's army on the low ground by the natural, this uh, this could be devastating. Could, could be. Could be. Um, Will it? Nah, probably not. But it could be devastating. I mean, he has rather... I mean, Protoss units are pretty mobile. They but... are. He hasn't really clumped his base up with a ton of buildings. Here comes the drop. Focus fire on the probes. Harvesting gas. Stim has been used. Good call on that. And uh, here comes Zerda. Actually, I think they'll be able to fly ah, away. He does pick them up. Loads up. But you gotta get the med back away. One more shot will do it. Oh! That hurt. Yep. Splash, splash. Splash, splash. And let's see. What Which, was you know what? I mean, worker killed? What was that? Ten workers killed? Not terrible. But now he's not mining here. No, he is not. So he has essentially shut down mining at the main. Which is actually going to slow down Splash's economy significantly. Speaking of slowing down, let's go faster. Alright, we're speeding up again. Colossus Tech is on the way for Splash. He has his first Colossus on the way with Thermal Lance in production. And back at Odinese, we have a... Uh, uh, More that... of the same. Reactor, what's it for? Is it for that? Is the Mobius reactor? Ah. So we have ghosts on the way. Ghosts are on the way, Ooh. which you know, I really would like to see more Terrans use this, but you know, he's very adamant on you sending these two Ford barracks out. Uh, yes, I, I don't know why, but okay. So these uh walled off barracks have been placed there to try and create some type of funnel. Splash is guarding his expansion very well. But, you know, I like that uh, Odinese is deciding to get out some Vikings. Uh, Vikings are a good call. Always helpful against the potential for giraffes. He does know that the Robo is on the way. I don't think he's got a glimpse of the uh, bay. Ghost. No, I saw it. Oh, he did see it, so that is a good call. Ghosts are on the field now. Do you think we're going to see a nuke? Uh, no. All right. I'm going to be surprised if we even see EMPs. I do hope we see MPs because snipe just not that 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 worthwhile. All right, looks like Odalie's sitting at 171 supply is going to finally move out. Splash only sitting at 108. But he has supply book, but he knows this is coming. He he does that. That observer is following this army. Odalie's checking for gold expansions. Not a bad idea at this stage in the game. And uh, if we want to slow it down, we're gonna watch Odalie slowly try and take out Splash now. Uh, you know. Uh, he can do it. Stim in. Don't allow any type of conclave to, to happen for the Protoss player, and he's got this. Yeah, nothing will be used from the Mothership Corps. Colossus will be able to do some damage from the back, but the Vikings are now starting to focus on him. There was actually one or two EMPs set off, weakening the shields from the Morals and some of the forward stalkers. Colossus goes down. And uh, I think this is GG. Uh, absolutely. Splash's supply levels are dropping drastically uh, like a heavy stone in water. And I'm pretty sure this is it, especially after this expansion goes down. Uh, most of the mining is going to be completely turned off for Splash. Just like a, a tap spitting out uh, puddles of water. What? <laughs> um, Vikings sent up to spot out for the army down below. Another EMP goes off, taking out the shields of half of those stalkers. Um, one ring gets, the, gets lucky and gets to ride in the med bay. Uh, yeah, that is actually the general. He gets to call the shots for this. Huge warping of stalkers, but the amount of marauders and marines plus their medvac buddies up in the air. Uh, I'm not I'm not sure he's going to last. Uh, he might be able to do a valiant last stand, like an Alamo tent move, but 
Another Colossus is down, but its brother falls in battle himself soon to follow suit. Uh, yeah, the Sockers are wiped out now. Uh, Marauders have free reign on the Colossus, which is gone. And uh, it does look like Spash, who's sitting at 19, 18, 17, 16. Uh, yeah, he's done. No, these, these few... Uh, Ooh, gateway's gone. Heroes Elks. Heroes Elks need to hide behind those cannons if they have any hope of surviving. No, look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Go. Artosis Pylon. Oh, look at you calling out stuff at 22 minutes into the game. Seriously. Well. Lol, G. Laughs all around. Kind of got some manners. So not not terrible, but we did have the fast forward that game. Yeah. All right, guys. Leave a comment down below. Send us your replays at superstarcarpos at gmail.com. Please. Hit that like button. Please send us your replays. Subscribe. Share. Uh, yeah. Good luck. Have fun. GG.